Let's dive into the fascinating world of the skeletal system. As an MBBS medical student, understanding the skeletal system is crucial for your practice. Here's a concise overview. Skeletal system. The skeletal system serves as the internal framework for the body. It consists of bones, cartilages, ligaments, and other connective tissues. Its primary functions include support, protection, and motion. Axial skeleton. The axial skeleton forms the central axis of the body. It includes vertebral column, spine, composed of individual vertebrae. The spine provides support and protects the spinal cord. Skull, houses the brain and sensory organs, eyes, ears, nose, and mouth. Hyoid bone, a unique bone in the throat region. Rib cage, protects vital organs like the heart and lungs. Sternum, breastbone, connects the ribs anteriorly. Appendicular skeleton. The appendicular skeleton comprises the bones of the limbs and their associated girdles. Pectoral, shoulder, girdle, includes the clavicle, collarbone, and scapula, shoulder blade. Pelvic, hip, girdle, consists of the hip bones, ilium, ischium, and pubis. Upper limbs, humerus, arm bone, radius, ulna, carpals, wrist bones, metacarpals, hand bones, and phalanges, finger bones. Lower limbs, femur, thigh bone, tibia, fibula, tarsals, ankle bones, metatarsals, foot bones, and phalanges, toe bones. Muscular system, the muscular system works closely with the skeletal system. It consists of muscles that allow movement, maintain posture, and generate heat. Muscles attached to bones via tendons. Cardiovascular system. The cardiovascular system includes the heart, blood vessels, and blood. Functions. Transport. Carries oxygen, nutrients, hormones, and waste products throughout the body. Circulation. Blood flows through arteries, veins, and capillaries. Heart. Pumps blood to all body tissues. Erect posture. Humans have an erect posture, which allows us to walk on two legs. Advantages. Freeze the arms for various tasks. Efficient locomotion. Challenges. Weight-bearing mechanics. Remember, as a medical student, you'll explore these systems in greater detail during your studies. Keep up the curiosity, and best of luck with your exams.
I did see the full moon now last night. But it was missing something though. Or was it just me looking for something to blame? For the weakness in my soul with which I came. So they said, relax, let the pill dissolve And leave all your aches and pains And so I tried to stay right there inside the current Oh, but the wind picked up and swept me clean skeletal system serve as the <clears throat> internal framework of the body it consists of bones cartilages cartilages ligaments and other connective tissue its primary function include support protection and motion axial skeleton the axial skeleton forms the center axis of the body. It includes vertebral column spine, that is, composed of individual vertebrae. The spine provides support and protect the spinal cord. Skull. House. This is the brain and sensory organs. That is eyes, ears, nose, and mouth. Hyoid bone. A unique bone 
in the throat region rib cage rib cage protects vital organs like heart and lungs sternum breastbone connects the rib anteriorly appendicular skeleton the appendicular skeleton compromises compromises the bone of the limb and their associated girdles that is pectoral shoulder girdle includes the clavicle collarbone and scapula shoulder blade 